Welcome to Vegan Method. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to make General Tso's tofu. So the first thing we need is 100 grams of pressed tofu. This is then cubed and ready to go into a marinade. For the marinade, I'm using a apple cider vinegar and a organic tamari soy sauce. So for the marinade, we're using one teaspoon of apple cider vinegar and three teaspoons of the soy sauce. You don't have to be too accurate with this, so don't worry too much about the measurements. So now we pop the tofu into the Tupperware tub with the marinade. We're gonna put the lid on and put it in the fridge for a minimum of 30 minutes. Ideally, if you can leave this overnight, it will soak up much more of the flavor. This is how the tofu looks after 24 hours. It's soaked up lots of the color and lots of the flavor. So we've now drained the tofu and we've got one tablespoon of corn flour in a ramekin, which we're gonna mix them both together in a plastic bag or you can use another Tupperware tub. Once the mix in the bag, you need to shake it like a Polaroid picture. I've now added a large pan with water, which I'm gonna to bring to the boil. And I've also got a frying pan which I'm just heating up. So I'm just adding some garlic infused extra virgin olive oil to the pan and then I'm going to add the tofu and we're going to start cooking it through. With the tofu cooking you just need to keep turning it to make sure it's crispy on all sides. So while the tofu is cooking in the background I'm going to make the sauce that we're going to add to the pan. For this, we're using three teaspoons of apple cider vinegar, and then we're gonna to add to it three teaspoons of soy sauce, one tablespoon of brown sugar, one teaspoon of corn flour, and then we're gonna give it a good stir. And then finally, I'm adding a tablespoon of water and some chili flakes. The tofu is crisping up nicely and when it's finished we're just going to take it out the pan and leave it to the side for a moment. So we need one garlic clove that's chopped up finely. We add this to the same pan that the tofu was in and then we're going to add the sauce. Keep stirring the sauce as it will thicken up and then we're going to add the vegetables. For this I've used sprouting broccoli and Brussels sprouts. If you don't like Brussels or broccoli, obviously you can change it out for something you do like. Now we're just going to add the tofu back into the pan and stir it round until the sauce thickens up and covers the vegetables and the tofu. After a few minutes the vegetables have softened and the sauce has thickened up nicely. I'm not going to cook this too long or too high because I like my vegetables al dente. To serve with the tofu, I have some soybean noodles. I'm going to bring the pan up to boiling, add the noodles to the water and then put it on simmer. It literally takes two minutes for these noodles to cook and then the dish will be ready. The tofu and vegetables are cooked, the sauce is nice and thick, so I'm just going to drain the noodles through a colander, put them into a bowl and put the tofu, vegetables and sauce on top. To finish the dish, I'm just sprinkling some sesame seeds over the plate and I'm going to add some freshly chopped chives. We have it, a finished dish that's fit for a general. Thank you for watching, please feel free to like, subscribe and leave comments below.